Oh, we're live. Hey, gang, I'm Summer. Welcome to Power Life, our community, virtual community. Um, this is Sculpt, so we're 45 minutes. You need your mat, a set of weights. This is fabulous Sophie. She's a teacher as well. Um, so that means she's going to have perfect form and do all the things without any breaks. Mm -hmm. Just kidding. You're all off the hook. From here, click play on your playlist and come into downward facing dog, please. Press with the L shape of your fingers. Send your hips high and back. Melt your heels towards your mat. Now you can take a few breaths, um, hinge forward and back, pedal through your feet, any movement you need. Um, but over the next 40 some minutes, I would like you to have an honest sort of conversation with yourself. Recently, my husband has informed me that I create my own crazy. And while you can imagine how that news was received, I will tell you it is a hard thing to admit, but kind of true. Um, several examples in my life lately, and I'm here to tell you I'm working on it. So for the next 40 ish minutes, when you are finding struggle, when you feel challenged, I would offer you to check in. See if you're creating your own struggle, knowing that when we look for struggle, it's exactly what we find. And see if you can shift your perspective, shift your attitude, dig yourself out. Take a big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, forward, fold. From here, find ragdoll pose. Take your feet wide. Yeah, so maybe hip distance, maybe mat distance, maybe a little wider. Bend generously through your knees. Feel your hamstrings stretch. Sophie has the option for a bind where she's grabbed her opposite elbow. It's a good option. You can find a bind behind your back. You can let your arms hang. Stay for a big breath in. Exhale, release your arms down. Inhale your right arm high. Ragdoll with a twist. Breathe here. Bend generously through your opposite knee. Square your hips towards your mat, but roll your top shoulder back. Roll through your wrists. Roll through your shoulders. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, release. Inhale your left arm high. Ragdoll with a twist. Breathe here. Same rules apply. Bend generously through your opposite knee. Roll through your wrist, your shoulder. Twist through your waist. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, forward fold. Heel toe your feet together. Inhale, halfway lift. Press your hands into your shins. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, mountain pose. Breathe here. Stack one vertebra on top of the next. Glide your shoulders away from your ears. Turn your pinkies in to bronze the backside of your body. Inhale. Exhale, mini back bend. Breathe here. Cactus your arms. As you squeeze your shoulder blades together, shine through your chest. Exhale. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Lengthen through your back. Exhale, chaturanga. Plant your hands, high plank. Lower to a mid plank. Graze your elbows along your rib cage. Inhale, upward facing. Press the tops of your feet into your mat. Exhale, downward facing. You've been here before. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, mini back bend. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. Oh, Sophie, it's like you've done these before. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, breathe here. Press all of your weight into your heels. Lift your toes, tuck your tailbone under. Inhale, exhale, chair, airplane arms. Breathe here, nothing changes to your legs. Squeeze your triceps. Turn your palms towards each other, pinch them in above your hips. Exhale. Inhale, lift your left leg, single leg mountain. Breathe here. Flex your toes towards your face. Squeeze your knee to hip height using the strength of your abdominals. Turn your pinkies in. Inhale. Exhale, crescent airplane arms. Step all the way back. Breathe here. Roll your back heel up over your toes. Stack your front knee over your front ankle. Parallel your hamstring with your mat. Exhale. Inhale, star pose. Big movement. Breathe here. Turn your toes. Slightly forward, make an X with your body. Inhale. Exhale, warrior two to the front. Breathe here. Again, stack your knee over your ankle. Press to the knife edge of your back foot as you parallel it with your mat. Big breath out. Inhale, reverse warrior. Breathe. Lengthen through both sides of your body before you reach back. Big breath in. Exhale, low lunge. Breathe here. 
Roll your back heel up slightly. Again, lock out your back leg. Exhale. Inhale, standing splits. Launch up. Continue to breathe. Put all of your body weight into your heel, your right heel. Press through your back heel. Big breath in. Exhale, forward fold. Ooh. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair pose. Let's flow the second side. Exhale, chair airplane arms. Inhale, single leg mountain. Lift your right knee. Exhale, crescent airplane arms. Inhale, star pose. Exhale, warrior two to the front. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, chaturanga. Just for good measure. We're actually taking them out. Don't worry. Just like my voice that's been overused, so my shoulders. We're taking chaturangas out, friends. You're welcome. Downward facing dog. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, hinge forward, high plank. Don't slap me, Sophie. High plank. Two push-up burpees. You got two push-ups. Right into a burpee. Let's pick it up. Two push-ups. Finish your burpee. Come down. Two push-ups. Finish your burpee. Oh, Sophie, go. I mean, I'm not doing these with her. Because I got to be able to breathe and get us to the next thing, girl. She's like, dang it. What I sign up for. So good, so good. Get the push-ups in. You can take push-ups from your toes. You can. You can do push-ups from your toes. Just try one. Until you face plant on the ground, you're in success place. You're in a successful place. Come on. Tell yourself you get a break up with your burpees. You get a break them up with the push-ups. Use your chest. Use your back. Use your core. Use your legs. Oh, my God. Everything's working. That's why it feels like this. Keep going. Eight seconds. Give them to me, Sophie. Last five. Three. Last two. Inhale, high plank. Hold, 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 hold it. Hold high plank. Stay and breathe. Hollow through your armpits. Dome through your back. Now bend through your elbows slightly. Oh, God, that's worse. Bend your elbows, Sophie. Dang. Big breath in. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good girl. Inhale, bend your knees. Look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Top of your mat. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, fold. Grab your dumbbells. Inhale, chair pose. You've got a narrow squat with a cab raise to a shoulder press. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press it up. Lower. Press it up. Inhale, down. Exhale, press it. Elbows to your knees. Press. Elbows to your knees. Lift your heels. Elbows to your knees. Lift your heels. Bring it down. Press it up. So good, friends. Squat down and press. Come up on to your toes. It's a narrow press. Work through the front side of your shoulders. It's a big movement, so it's cardio too. I know, I know, more cardio. That's what Sculpt is, friends. It's not just a lovely flow. It's a lovely flow with weighted exercises. You've got it. Pull your belly up and in. Squeeze at the top. Five more seconds. Last three. Two. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair airplane arms. Tricep kickbacks. Inhale a bend. Exhale, kick it. Lower. Press. Lower. Press. Glue your elbows above your rib cage. Bend your elbows 90 degrees, then lock them out. Bend to 90, lock it out. I want your knuckles to face the ground only. Face the ground only. So resist the urge to bring them in front of your hips. Stop them here. Yeah. Back. Stop them. Set them back. Oh, so good. Want you to keep the work in your triceps. Lock out your triceps. When you begin to swing like this, you build momentum. You use your biceps. You're not doing yourself any favors. Be in this hot mess moment. At this point, maybe look for the struggle. Maybe find a way to make it a little bit harder. But then remind yourself you're strong enough to get through this. At least eight seconds of it. Think lower in your chair, please. Everybody, we all do it. Last three. Two. Exhale, chair, airplane arms. Inhale, lift your left leg, single leg mountain. Figure four squat. Bring your ankle above your knee. Sink down to a figure four. Squeeze it up. Inhale, tailbone back. Exhale, squeeze it forward. 
Inhale, tailbone back. Exhale, drive your glutes forward. Sink down. Press it up. Sink down. Press it up. If you are struggling through this, it's a lot of balance. And it's a single leg squat, friends. This is freaking hard. Kickstand your toe. You still get the majority of the work in your right butt cheek, in your right quad, but you get it without like falling over. So good. Five, you get to add on. Three, two, sink down your figure four, pull your elbows back, palms in. Exhale, press up, chest press. Inhale, narrow row. Exhale, chest press. Inhale, pull it back. Exhale, press it up. Inhale, pull it back. Exhale, press it up. You've got it. Graze your elbows along your rib cage. Think like a tricep push-up. Press out. Squeeze your chest. I want cleavage. Cleavage in public. Well, we're in public. Would you call this public? Yes. I mean, it's just the two of us, but somebody's out there watching, right? You got it. You got it. So good. So good. Know that this is a balanced challenge. We are here to burn out your right leg. It's a thing, friends. Embrace the shake. Embrace the weeble wobble. Flex your toes. Five. Three. Last two. Inhale, single leg mountain. Exhale, crescent. Airplane arms. Step it back. Back fly. Face your palms towards each other. Put all your body weight over your front heel. Inhale, lower. Exhale, pinch it back. Inhale, round. Exhale, pinch. Round it. Pull it back. Round it. Pull towards your hips. Towards your hips. Squeeze through your back. So good, friends. Know that your right butt cheek kind of done. It's kind of over it in single leg mountain. Now it's really over it. Are you on the struggle bus? When you look for struggle, guess what you find? More struggle. Instead, choose to feel strong here. Take that sensation screaming from your backside and say, I'm getting stronger. Change is happening. I mean, it's upon us. You want to see change. You got to feel it first. It doesn't come for free. It's the price of admission. Keep going. For five, three, two, exhale, chair, airplane, excuse me, crescent, airplane, arms. Inhale, star pose. Pull your weights towards heart center. Reach them out. Exhale, warrior two. Weights to heart center. Warrior two to the front. Warrior two. Pull your elbows in. You've got a hammer curl. We'll go a W curl, an inverted curl. To the side, to your chest. Dumbbells apart. Dumbbell touch. So you're making like an upside down V. Ooh. Rotate through your bicep. Flex your guns. Get a lower in your warrior two. So good. How you doing, Sophie? Yeah, just living her best life. The only one in class. I know it's hard. So when you feel like you're struggling being by yourself at home, Sophie's by herself working, but she's not by herself. I'm on her like white on rice. Be glad it's not you, right? There's no escape, Sophie. Sink lower. Yes, girl. So good, so good. Squeeze through your biceps. We want you to flex your guns. Create sensation in your arms. Your legs will take care of themselves. A few more, honey. You get to add a three-quarter lift on your W curl. In three, two, Come up three quarters, lower hold. Up three quarters, lower hold, inside. Up three quarters, lower hold, inside. Up three quarters, lower hold as you curl in. Come up three quarters. Whew. Up three quarters, three quarters only. That means we do not straighten our legs. You stay in the work. Come up three quarters of the way. Yes, you flirt with that line that's saying, honey, honey, stand up. And you don't do it. You don't do it. You keep going. You push past that point, past that comfort zone. So good, so good. Keep squeezing through your biceps. Five more. Last three. Two. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Pull, pivot, plant your weights. Low lunge, plant your hands. Mountain climbers, mountain climbers, go, go, go. Drive your knees. Drive, 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 drive. You at home too. Spike your heart rate. Get it up. Give me everything you've got, Sophie. Come on, girl. 
five seconds. Yeah, Sophie's screaming. Sophie's having fun. You can have fun here. I mean, once I stop talking and start counting down, right? Way more fun then. Five seconds, girl. Come on. Last three. Two. Right foot forward. Hug your right knee to your chest. Plant it down. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, standing splits. Shiva squats. Inhale, lower. Exhale, kick. Inhale, knees kiss. Exhale, kick it. Kiss your knees. Press it back. Kiss them. Standing splits. Sink it down. Standing splits. Kiss them. Press back. Everything bends and lowers. Everything lengthens. Keep going. So if you weren't sure that your right butt cheek was done, now we're making sure. Lift your front toes. Lift them up. You don't need them. Put all of your body weight into your heels. So good. Now, you have dumbbells at the top of your mat. You can use them as stilts, not crutches. That means bring the pads of your fingertips only to your dumbbells to bring the ground closer to you. Put the work in your heel, in your core, in your legs. But we get to add on, Sophie. Yeah. Sink it down. Press it up at a calf. Raise in a hamstring lift. Sink. Lift it. Sink. Lift your heel. Sink it down. Lift your heel and your hamstring. Lower. Heel and hamstring. Lower. Pinch it up. Lower. Pinch it up. Lower. How you doing, girl? Yeah, she's ready to get out. She's ready to get out. Palms off your dumbbells, please. Oh, God. Five seconds. Last three, two, inhale, standing splits, exhale, forward fold, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, forward fold, no weights, inhale, chair pose, exhale, chair, airplane arms, inhale, single leg mountain, lift your left again, lift your left again, single leg mountain, into a warrior three, hinge up, single leg, Kick it back, warrior three. I'm bringing my hands to hard center because I don't trust my balance to have like just a hinge forward up and down like this. This is harder. This is harder. So I bring my hands in and press. Bring them in, press. Tuck it in, lift. Tuck it in, press. Glide your hips behind your right ankle. Yeah, you feel your hamstring just like light up in that hot moment. So good, so good. Look at something not moving. Not me, not me. Kick through your heels, so good. Use the strength of your lower belly to drive your knee up. Send your booty back. Kick through your heel. Drive your glutes. Abs. Booty back through your heel. Five more seconds, honey. Last three, two. Inhale, single leg. Exhale, crescent airplane arms. Inhale, star pose. We gotta skip to a skater. You skip to the top, skate to the back. Skip to the top, skate to the back. Skip, hop on your right foot, skate to your left. Hop at the top, skate to the back. Come on, come on. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. I mean, let's just bump it a little bit if you're at home. Crank it up. And this is how you lose your voice. <laughs> Keep going. Think about a lateral Mario jump. Sophie's killing it. She's killing it. Her right leg is like hot, fire, flame. Get it, girl. Five. Last three. Two. Inhale, star pose. Whoo. Exhale, warrior two to the front. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Low lunge. Pull your belly off your thighs. You've got a forward complex. You pulse. Knee drive. Kick. Switch. Pulse. Drive your knee. Kick. Switch. Pulse. Drive your knee. Kick. Switch. Pulse. Drive your knee. Kick. Switch. As it gets a little bigger, you pulse. Knee drive. Kick, switch. So good. So good. No weights, friends. No weights. You can get stronger and spike your heart rate, which is what your mama gave you. At home, you don't have to leave. Keep going. Keep going. 
Oh, Sophie girl, I'm waiting for you to like fatigue, but she's in good shape. It's gonna take a minute. I got time, I got time. Eight seconds, so good, honey. Last five, last three, right foot forward, and two, exhale, low lunge. Inhale, standing split, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold, bend your knees, sink your booty down, grab your dumbbells, come on to your back. Let's switch to core, slow your heart rate, boats with rows. Come into boat pose, lean back, flatten your back, pull your belly up and in, glide your shoulders away from your ears. Inhale, center, exhale, twist. Inhale, center, exhale, twist. To the center, twist it. To the center, twist. Keep your head above your heart, just catch your breath. Use your obliques. It's not about touching your elbow to the ground. It's about twisting through your waist while keeping your spine long. If you can touch the ground with your elbow, great. If you can't, great. Keep going, keep going. Now I'd remind you about where you find struggle. I'm finding struggle with my left earbud right now. So apologies for any noise, more raspiness than I'm already giving you. Stay in it. Last five, four, last three. Two, lower all the way to your back. Kick your legs out to a hover. Inhale your arms overhead. Overhead lat extension with a hover hold. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Lower down, squeeze your lats, waist above your chest. Waist above your head, pinch above your chest. Above your head, above your chest. Keep going, flex through your feet. Kick your legs out long, I want them at a hold. Now your hold may be like two inches off the mat. You are a stronger, stronger person than I am. Mine is usually about 45 degrees. The point is, take it to where you feel it the most, where you can keep your lower back glued to your mat, but like your midsection's on fire. How you doing, Sophie? Woo! Yeah. Also, as you go overhead, stretch through your lats and squeeze them to bring your dumbbells back up over your chest. Stretch through your lats. Now flex them back up. We're working your back and your core together. It's no coincidence. We build our back to create the illusion of a smaller waistline. So here we are. Here we are just living our best life, hitting our entire core, but you're just gonna lay on your mat, friends. It's not so bad. That's five. Add on in four, three, get a move, Sophie. And two, inhale, lengthen, exhale, lift both legs with your dumbbells. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, lift everything to the ceiling. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale to a hover. Exhale, squeeze it up. Keep going. Breaking up our standing work with a little bit of core. Tell yourself it's a break. It's a break. You're just going to lay down. Perspective, friends. A few more. I mean, we're gonna make it bigger, you realize that. We're just gonna keep layering on. Last three, two, inhale everything long. Exhale, crunch it up, add a hip, lift and a crunch. Inhale, lower, exhale, crunch it up and lift. Inhale, lower, exhale, pull it up, crunch and lift. Lower down, bring it up, hip and shoulder lift. Lengthen, press towards your heels, come on. So good. You're almost there. Five more seconds. Last three, two, bring your heels to the ground. Bend your knees. Overhead, lat extension into a sit up. Ooh. Overhead, into a sit up. Overhead, sit up. Press your dumbbells to the ceiling. Now you're into your upper abdominals because you've got the crunch involved. Notice not really a break through your lower abdominals, but we're not isolating them. So everything's working. Bend your elbows. So good, so good. Squeeze your shoulder blades back at the top. Pull your biceps behind your ears. Also, I said this before. All I hear in this hot mess moment is WTF, but this song is called What the Funk, F-U-N-K. 
I wouldn't do that to you guys. Five more seconds. Although the colorful language always helps me push through. Maybe you need to grunt. Maybe you need to growl. Maybe you need to yell some obscenities. I mean, not you, Sophie, but you at home. Five seconds. Last three. Two. Rock and roll forward and back. Hug your knees into your chest. Build some momentum. Plant your dumbbells at the top of your mat. Meet me in high plank. What? High plank. I know. I know. Big breath in. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Grab your dumbbells. Inhale, chair pose. Heel toe your feet out wide. Wide squat, calf raise with a chest, shoulder press. Inhale, lower. Exhale, thrust it up. Elbows to your knees and thrust. Touch them. Lift your heels. Touch. Press. Touch. Press. Touch. Press. Elbows to your knees. Lift your heels. Sink it down. Press it up. It's a thruster. It's a thruster. With a calf raise. Up. Notice in this posture, unlike our narrow squat, with the wide turnout, you hit your calves at a different angle. Yes. So he's like, screw this. You do what you need to do, friends, just to stay in the work. There's no shame in that game. In fact, it's quite the opposite. So often our ego holds us hostage. We carry the dumbbells, even the lightweights, right? The heavyweights, the lightweights, past the point we need them. They are just props to get you to the sensation faster. Once you're there and you feel like, hot damn, I can't do another one, you drop those suckers and knock your reps out. Breathe it tight. In this variation, you also get more glutes. Your strong side, your back side. I can see you, Sophie. Son of a. Five more. Last three. Two, inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair, airplane, arms, tricep, kick up. Turn your palm up. Inhale, bend. Exhale, lift. Inhale, bend. Exhale, lift. Dumbbell to your hips. Press it back to your hips. Press it back to your hips only. Press them. So we're talking about hitting our muscles at different angles. This is no different. Same rules apply as your tricep kickback. Glue your elbows in space, then lock out your triceps. Lock them out. Lock them out. Make it smaller. Make it more controlled. Bring your dumbbell just to your hips. Not even past, like to the meaty part where the dimple can be. I mean, not us. Not us. Because we work our abductors. There's no dimple in our backside. Right, Sophie? No. There's none there. But if there was, bring it there. Press it back. To there. Press it back. So good. Smaller and tighter, please. Ooh, Sophie, I see a little tremble and shake, girl. That makes me so happy. That means it's working. That means we can, like, get out of this soon. Five seconds. Last four. Three. Two. Chair, airplane, arms, exhale. Inhale, lift your right leg, single leg, mountain. Bring your waist to heart center. Figure four squats. Inhale, send your tailbone back. Exhale, drive your glutes forward. Inhale, sink it down. Exhale, drive it up. Inhale to lower. Exhale to squeeze. Inhale down. Exhale, pinch it up. You've got it. Again, you have the option to, instead of have the spine, bring your toes. Just your toes to touch so you can sink down and up with stability. The majority of the work is still in your left leg. So whatever option you took on side one, take it on side two. Unless, of course, you're about to fall over and then modify accordingly. You got it. We get to add more back and chest. Of course. Of course. In three, two, inhale, sink it down. Low row with your palms face up. Exhale, chest pressed. Inhale, lower your palms face up. Exhale, press, palms face up. Inhale, pull. Exhale, press. Slow and controlled. Squeeze your belly up and into your rib cage. You've got it. With your arms, fix your palms up. You get like a low row as you squeeze your shoulder blades back. As you press forward, squeeze your chest. You feel a little bit of work in your biceps, just with the extension, but we want you to squeeze your chest here. This is getting you out of a million push-ups, by the way. So squeeze your chest, Sophie. Five more seconds. I know you're weeble wobbling all over the place. That's a good sign. That means you have instability because your muscles are fatiguing. Last three. Two. Inhale, single leg, mountain. Exhale, crescent, airplane arms. Step back. 
We've got a reverse grip fly. So your palms still face forward. Inhale lower, exhale, squeeze it up and back. Inhale down, exhale fly. Lower, lift it up. Inhale lower, exhale lift. With the reverse grip fly. It looks a lot like your back fly. With your palms forward, you get more rear delts. You're welcome. Your rear delts, you guys, are so hard to target. But they are what make your boulder shoulder look so damn good. So squeeze it back. Yes, girl. Hinge forward more. Bend your front knee 90 degrees. Dang. Come on. Show up. Show up on this side, too. Hinge forward, Sophie. She's like, son of a, find somebody else. Sorry, Sophie. <laughs> Just you and me, honey. Five more seconds. Last three. Two. Inhale, start pose. Exhale, warrior two. Let me turn, let me turn. Towards the front, towards the front. Warrior two, towards the front. Back to our bicep curls are in and out. Palms face up to the side. Palms face up as you curl in. Palms up. Palms in. Palms up. Palms in. You've got it. When you curl in the center, bring your knuckles together. Let them touch. Flex. Let them touch. Flex. Feel the rotation through your bicep. Keep on flexing. Keep pressing blood into your muscles. Now get lower in your warrior two. Yeah, I'm calling myself out. I've done like five things this whole time and I'm cheating. I get it. I get it. Stay with it. I'm coming by you, Sophie, so I don't forget which way I'm facing and what leg I'm on. Fair. Take it down. Yes, yes, yes. When you bring your dumbbells in, bring your knuckles together. Yes. So you're making a W in front of your body as well. You get the three-quarter raise as your weights come out in three. Last two. Three-quarter raise, lower hold. Three-quarter raise, lower hold. Bring it in. Out. In. Lift out. Hold in. Lift out. Hold in, lift out, three quarters only, three quarters. That means you do not straighten your legs. What are you not gonna do, Sophie? She said it, she made it a thing. Dang it, she's committed. She was coerced, but she's killing it, she's killing it. You're killing it at home. I mean, as long as you're not sitting down and taking a water break, you're killing it at home. And if you are, I mean, you're still doing a fantastic job. Come back when you're ready. I can't tell you how many YouTube videos I've watched. I've watched over quarantine. Like, that's a good idea. I like that. Eating my snacks. Five seconds. You've got this, girl. Last three. Two. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Pull, pivot, plant your weight. Hands down, cross body, mountain climbers. Bring your knee to your opposite elbow. Drive, drive, drive. Twist through your waist. You're ready. You've already hit your obliques and boat with rows. You're ready to twist here. You're ready to twist here. Imagine a towel. You're wringing it out. That's happening in your midsection. Come on. Eight more seconds, Sophie, as fast as you can, girl. Get your mean face on. She can't do it. She's so sweet. Five seconds. Yeah, you can, Sophie. Last three. Two. Left foot forward. Left foot forward. Exhale. Low lunge. Inhale. Standing splits. Shiva squats. Inhale lower. Exhale kick. Inhale down. Kick it out. Lower, make an L with your legs. Lower, make a capital L. I mean, it's an upside down L. It's a horrible analogy. Just kick through your heel. I mean, think about it. Inhale your knees to kiss. Exhale to kick it. Five seconds. We add a calf raise and a hamstring lift. In two. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Sink it down. Squeeze it up. Sink it down. Squeeze it up. Sink it down. Lift your calf. Oh, pull it to the back of your knee. Cheese it. It's going to end, I promise, in eight. Last five. Almost there. Three. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. No weight. Exhale, chair, airplane arms. Inhale, single leg. Lift your right. Single leg mountain. Warrior three. Single leg mountain. Warrior three, 
Press it up. Press it back. Reach to the ceiling. Parallel your belly with your mat. Press it up. Kick it back. Press it up. We're having like a Beyonce moment. We're in sync. As long as one of us doesn't fall over, I think it's going to be me. <laughs> it's going to be me. <laughs> it's going to be you. Know that that's a thing. Creating instability. It's a lot of balance. Squeeze your belly up and in. But your butt cheek is like done. And that's us doing all the work here. Stay in as long as you can. Five more seconds. You can do anything for three. Last two. Inhale, single leg. Exhale, crescent airplane arms. Inhale, star pose. Back to our skip to skaters. You skip to the top, skate to the back. Skip to the top, skate to the back. So you're skipping on your left leg, friends. Your left leg, your leg that's dying. That's dying. Watch to fall off. That one. Your last cardio burst. Your last cardio burst. We are so close to being done with this sucker. Go bigger. Point your toes in the air. Yes, girl. Feel your inner thighs light up. Jump the length, your whole length of your mat. Whole length of your mat. Get it out. Yes. Five. Last three. Two. Inhale, star pose. Exhale, warrior two to the front. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Pull your belly off your thighs. We've got a reverse complex. You pulse. Hamstring curl. Back kick. Switch. Pulse. Hamstring. Back kick. Switch. Pulse. Hamstring, back kick, switch, pulse, hamstring, back kick, switch, pulse, hamstring, back kick, switch, pulse, hamstring, kick back, switch, keep going. This is it, my friends. You are in cool down right after this. This is your last chance. Your last chance to send your heart rate through the roof or kind of recover. Just keep moving. Just keep moving. Burn through your legs, no weight, no weight. How you doing, Sophie girl? Full disclosure, Sophie and I may have jacked this up the first time, but because she's a teacher, I'm like, we can just start over. So I have no idea when we started this class. I feel like we're almost done, but I don't have a time stamp on this. Just saying. We're gonna be right around 45-ish minutes. You got it, Sophie, you got it. Five more seconds. Last three, two. Exhale, low lunge, left foot forward. Inhale, see any splits. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, high plank. Step it back, lower to your belly, prepare for a low cobra. Press the tops of your feet into your mat. Place your hands beneath your shoulders. Inhale, low cobra, breathe here. Use the strength of your back to lift your torso up off your mat. Now press the tops of your toe into your mat. Stay and breathe, stay and breathe. Inhale up one more inch, release your glutes. Exhale, release. Place your right cheek on your mat. Extend your arms behind you. Bend your knees. Windshield wipers through your legs like she already knows it feels good in her body. Now your lower back's super happy. Prepare for one more round. Extend your legs, bring your hands beneath your shoulders. Inhale, low cobra, stay and breathe. Press tap your feet down, relax your glutes. Inhale, up one inch. Exhale, release, place your left cheek on your mat. Bring your arms behind you, bend your knees. Windshield wiper through your legs, place side to side. Place your hands beneath your shoulders. Gaze towards your mat. Inhale through high plank or tabletop. Exhale to your knees. Swing your legs out in front. Inhale your arms overhead. Exhale seated forward fold. Grab the knife edge of your feet so you can stretch your entire hamstring. Knife edge, friends. Now hinge from your hips. Lengthen through your spine. Reach your chest towards your toes. You can slowly work to bring the backs of your knees towards your mat. It doesn't matter, just stretch through your hamstrings. Big breath in, exhale, let it go. Inhale slowly, roll up. Come all the way to your back. Inhale your arms overhead, full body stretch. Exhale, hug your knees to your chest. Allow your knees to fall to the left for a supine twist. 
Stack your right hip on top. Plant your shoulder blades on your mat. Stay and breathe. Find a stretch in the middle of your back. If you're feeling any lower back sensation, release your heels from your booty. Release your knees from your chest. Stay and breathe. Either T or cactus through your arms. Any stretch through your chest is just a bonus. Big breath in. Exhale slowly, carefully come back through center. Hug your knees and reset your spine. Allow them to fall to the right, supine twist, other side. Stack your left hip on top. Plant blue, both shoulder blades to your mat. Continue to breathe. Find the same sensation. May not be the same posture. Personally, I like my shins parallel with my mat, touching the edge of it. Inhale. Exhale slowly. Come back through center. Find a figure four stretch. Bring your right ankle above your left knee. I love the option that Sophie's taken to reach through the keyhole she created. Grab onto her hamstring. Find a juicier stretch here. If you're like me and you're just too sweaty for that mess, take it from your seat. I'm talking right here, friends. Down and dirty. Flex your toes wherever you've landed to protect your knee joint. Maybe you sway side to side. Stay for a big breath in. Exhale, release, switch it out. Left ankle above your right knee. Flex your toes. Press your left knee away from your body. If you've reached through the keyhole and you're pulling on your leg, there's no point if you're collapsing your knee into your chest. Press it away. Feel the stretch through your hip abductor, your side booty. Big breath in. Exhale, release. Hug your knees into your chest, reset. Find happy baby, grab the nice edge of your feet. Press your feet up towards the ceiling as you pull them with your hands. Now place your entire tailbone back on your mat. Sway side to side, rock your baby. Imagine you could foot five your neighbors. Big breath in. Exhale, hug your knees to your chest. One final squeeze, release to your Shavasana. I'll pull you out in just a moment. Slowly begin to wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes. Inhale your arms overhead, full body stretch. Exhale, roll to your right side, supported fetal position. Rest your head on your bicep, curl your knees into your chest. And take this moment to acknowledge the areas in your practice, in your life, off your mat, where you find struggle, where you are faced with challenges and have that conversation with yourself. So my husband pointed out to me, which was not well received, but no less true, I create my own crazy. What's gonna happen to school in the fall? I don't know which days are my kids going to school? What if they have to shut it down? What's gonna happen to my teaching schedule? Blah, blah, blah. All these things, all these things we cannot control, but we can respond to. So rather than feeding the machine, feeding the crazy, dwelling on things, complaining about things, cause that's a spiral. And once you start that, it continues and it like increases in frequency. <laughs> Rather than going there, have that honest conversation with yourself. Check in, know where you are unnecessarily taking it beyond where it needs to go. 
creating your own crazy, creating your own struggle. When you look for struggle, that is what you find. Look for the blessings, look for the positivity, look for the helpers around you. They are there. And the more you see that, the lighter your life is, the better your life is, the better you respond. And you can actually see the light and how well you have it and how prepped you are and how you're going to get through this whole thing. When you're ready, slowly press up to a comfortable seated position. Inhale your arms overhead, one last stretch. Exhale your hands in through heart center. You, my friends, are so freaking strong. You are worthy. You are enough. And your presence is needed here. We seal our practice. So good, girl. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a fabulous, fabulous rest of your day, week, summer. Lord knows what's going to happen, but we're going to get through it together. Thank you, guys.